Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for stopping by and visiting with me. This is going to be part two. Um, we're going to be working on this one. Let me, did I show you the flip through on this one? I don't think I did. But here is the layout and I believe I shared this one with you on the camera. I feel like I did. Maybe I didn't. But this, there's no journaling. I just put like the basically little introduction page together. Here is my second layout. And in here, I just put my favorite. Yeah, I'm making sure. My page here is kind of thick, so I just wanted to make sure it was one. But uh, one of my favorite Bible quotes, you guys know this, I've talked about it all the time. And it's basically the way of love. It's 1 Corinthians 13, um, 4, through 13 which normally everybody just stops in four through eight which is the first paragraph but i also like the eight through 13 because it, to me very important so just wanted to document a little bit about that here this one's kind of falling apart i see that but i just wanted to make a pretty oops a pretty um, layout in my journaling is inside the envelope so uh, this is just basically a pretty decoration but my journaling is in here and what did I journal about oh something something private but yes I journaled in here so my journaling is in there and then, hold on, let me try to do I just think it looks so pretty. And then you flip it, and I put a little bit of um, cluster here with a photo of my kids and like a little photo booth. And then I had this little ephemera that right now sent to me, and I just thought it would be perfect because it's also like a photo booth and then I just journaled a little bit in here which is just a little quote that I found on Pinterest then you flip it over and this is the page where we're going to work on and I've made another little cluster here and I just made it with whatever I could look you guys I um Back when Tiffany was selling stickers, I bought a few from her and this was her little business cards that she sent as a thank you and I just thought it was so pretty that I just used it in here for whatever. I journaled on this guest check receipt and then in the back is just a photo of my husband. And so um, I had that there. And so we are going to be working on the other part of this layout. And I've already had this little piece of paper, which I actually went to dig because I was like, oh my gosh, what am I going to do? And even though the, the layouts are not going to be identical because I did them separately, I am going to kind of tie them in together. Let me uh, get this out so that I could, I could um, do my holes first before I do anything. Hopefully it's kind of straight. Probably messed that up, but okay. So that's that. And this is this one Now we could put it away. And for this layout, so see, this is my intent. When you pull to, to read the journal here, then you'll find my husband's photo on the back. But uh, for this side, I'm gonna use this pretty picture of my daughter. And there's gonna be no journaling in there, no nothing, I just, want to basically make like a little cluster of her and this is what I've kind of gathered put together of course I'm going to try to tie it in with the colors of that but it should be a simple layout I'm sure this video to get started and hopefully it comes together in no trouble at all 
So let's see, what do we have here? Let's do that one. And I was gonna do this whole thing, but I don't know that how it would look. So probably scratch that idea. Um, okay, let's do some piecing together. Enjoy this layout something honestly just putting a little cluster together and trying to blend it over here so hopefully it turned out okay hope that you guys like it sorry this video happened by and I will see you guys in the next video have a good one bye